I'm glad to see you again. I can't wait to see what will happen next. I'm glad you made these decisions last time. This is our story. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll never negotiate with their slaves. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. The dialogue is the only way. I'm sure the humans will listen to us. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you That's <laughs> enough! And now what are we gonna do? There are five Cyber Life stores across the tree. All selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. Our people will remember. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna continue on with our Detroit Become Human series. And as always, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and also comment on the channel. Alright, let's hopefully start a revolution without any bloodshed. I've been waiting a long time for this. She is bloodthirsty. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. The store's over here. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's 10 minutes until all our teams attack. What are we waiting for? We're gonna sweep the plaza. Make sure we're not disturbed. And how do you want to deal with the shop window? Not now. One problem at a time. Okay, now what's next? Exactly what we need to ram the store. free.
see what more is there. Come on. You are free. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Mention of androids, which release humanity from the bonds of labor, set man free to pursue the high goals, scale to the heights of learning, love, and leisure. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. Surveillance drone. We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. I don't know how to get to it. Oh, it's over here. Constructing. didn't have time to call the cops. We'll soon find out. Alright. There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. It's one way. It shouldn't be too difficult. You're free now.
There. Nobody should bother us now. system found it storytelling but the controls are a little bit on the wonky side You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Plaza secure. Now we can get inside the store. Okay, let's go get the truck. Get that truck out. I wonder what you'd do without me. something fun. Oh, she is very destructive.
You don't have to obey them. You're free. My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom, and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm, I'm with you, you Marcus. Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! You're with I'm with you! I'm with you! Then follow me! Marcus, what are you doing? I'm going to send the humans a message. Yes, this will be violent. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow.
This message is the hope of a people. You gave us love. And now the time is coming for you to give us a We ask that you recognize our dignity and our hopes and our words. Together, we can live in peace. of our people. We did it. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice.
They killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. You don't have to do this. No. Please. Please. We won't punish a crime with another crime. You can't always let your anger get the best We interrupt of you. this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. At exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro-android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of Cyber Life stores, and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the Cyber Life stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? Ooh, so many different choices. Oh, there was one other thing here. Well then. Oh, I was probably just ramming it. Okay. I'm not a fan of revolution through violence. Just because it tends to get nowhere really quickly. And public opinion does matter. Alright everyone, this is this particular episode. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Later!